Now let us solve this math Olympiad question and it says let x be a real number such that the cube root of x plus 1 all over the cube root of x equals 3. Then x cubed plus 1 over x cubed equals what? Alright? Now for us to start solving this now. Now let's look at uh, this equation here. Now let's make the term the cube root of x equals another you know just one alphabet or one term so that uh, will say y equals the cube root of x now if y equals to the cube root of x now let us find what the value of x will be and by so doing we can raise both sides to the power of 3 Now at this point, this the cube root we eliminate the cube, so we are left with that y raised to the power of three equals x. Okay, all right. Now, if y raised to the power of three equals x, now take note that here y equals three raised to the uh, uh, the cube root of x. Okay. Now this equation here can also be rewritten in terms of y as y plus 1 all over y equals 3. Okay? Alright. So, um, let's make this like uh, equation 1. Okay? Alright. So, so that we get to know when and when to use which. Okay. Now that we've simplified the equation here, to give you y plus 1 all over y equals 3. Okay? And here we now know that x, which is the same thing as this, x equals y raised to the power of what? 3. Okay? Now let's bring this equation out here that x raised to the power of 3 plus 1 all over x raised to the power of 3. Now let's take note that at this point x equals y to the power of 3, right? So it also implies here that we can say this is y to the power of 3 because x, x itself is y to the power of 3. And here we are having x to the power of 3. So it implies that y cube raised to the power of 3 then plus 1 all over y cube raised to the power of what? 3. Okay? So and this will give us y raised to the power of 9 then plus y re, I mean 1 all over y raised to the power of what? 9. Okay? So it implies that this expression on the left will give us y raised to the power of 3 or raised to the power of 3 then plus y all over y raised to the power of 3 or raised to the power of what? 3. Okay, so to this end now we now we move further. So to this point, now let us recall. Now first thing, let us recall according to uh, algebraic uh, the sum of two cube. We give us a plus b as a and b is the term we are we are using here raised to the power of three minus three a b into a plus b okay all right so now to this point here that we have y plus one all over y equals three okay now let's have an algebraic equation for y raised to the power of three then plus one all over y raised to the power of three okay all right so to this end here here it implies now take note that y i mean one raised to the power of three all over y raised to the power of three is the same thing as saying 
1 all over y raised to the power of what? 3. Which make uh, 1 all over y a term for b. Okay? Which can also be written as 1 all over y raised to the power of 3. Because 1 raised to the power of 3 is 1. Okay? So, here it implies that a is a, is a y and b is a 1 all over y. Okay? So, here we have uh, y plus 1 all over y all raised to the power of 3. Then minus 3 times y times 1 all over y into uh, y plus 1 all over y. Okay? Now, the whole of this here now becomes... Now, let's just take note that 1... I mean, y plus 1 over y equals to 3. So here we have 3 raised to the power of 3. Then minus a y element this y because a term multiplied by its reciprocal is 1. So then into here we have uh, that will be 3. So here we have 27. Oh, sorry. Then, sorry, sorry, here we have, uh, this is 3, then into 3. So this will be 27 minus 9, should give us what, 18. Okay, now that we've gotten the value for uh, y raised to the power of 3, plus 1 all over y raised to the power of 3, which is 18. Now, let's come over to this. Okay, so, in this term here. Take note that the whole of this expression x raised to the power of 3 plus y 1 over x raised to the power of 3 is the same thing as y cubed raised to the power of 3 then plus 1 all over y cubed raised to the power of 3. Now this also can be expressed in terms of this sum of 2 cubed like y raised to the power of 3 all raised to the power of 3 then plus now the whole of this the numerator here is the same thing as saying 1 raised to the power of 3, all raised to the power of 3, then uh, all over y raised to the power of 3, all raised to the power of what, 3, which can be rewritten also as y raised to the power of 3, all raised to the power of 3, then plus here is the same, so we can say this is 1, then all over. Uh, y raised to the power of 3, everything all raised to the power of 3, which is the same thing as saying y raised to the power of 3, all raised to the power of 3, then plus 1 raised to the power of 3 is 1. Okay, also raised to the power of 3 again, it is also 1. So, but for uh, emphasis see here, okay, let me see, this will be 1 all over y raised to the power of 3 or raised to the power of what, 3. Okay, now we can see resemblance of A and B in this, in this expression. Where A here represent y cube, y raised to the power of 3, and B represent 1 all over what, y raised to the power of 3. Alright, let us now apply it here. Now to this end, so we can now say that y raised to the power of 3 or raised to the power of 3 plus 1 all over y raised to the power of 3 or raised to the power of 3 will now give us now our a. Now this is our a. Okay, let me just do it like this. This is a raised to the power of 3 then plus b raised to the power of 3. Okay? So which will now be our a here which is y raised to the power of 3 then plus our b 1 all over y raised to the power of 3 all raised to the power of 3 then minus 3 then times our a is y raised to the power of 3 times 1 all over y raised to the power of 3 which is our b then open brackets then our a is uh, y raised to the power of 3 then plus 1 all over y raised to the power of 3. Alright, so to this end, since we have a term 
multiplying its reciprocal so it becomes one now let us now recall that from here that y cubed plus one over y cubed equals 18 so let us you know uh plug in the value of y cubed plus one over y cubed as 18 so here we have 18 cubed then minus 3 into 18 right so and our 18 cube here punching our calculator here we have 5 8 3 2 then minus here should have a 54 now which will definitely give us a 5 7 7 8 all right now let us take note that the whole of this that x raised to the power of 3 plus 1 all over x to the power of 3 is equals to y raised to the power of 3 all raised to the power of 3 then plus 1 all over y raised to the power of 3 all raised to the power of 3 and as long as the expression on the left is equal to the expression on the right and expression of the right gives us 5 7 7 8 then x raised to the power of 3 plus 1 over x raised to the power of 3 equals to 5 7 7 8 final answer all right thank you and god bless you